Okay, now my Raps key is enabling and disabling strength. Good to know. So, this passageway we opened up earlier. You can learn to use ladders. I feel like the safest thing in the world. Right, I think we're probably gonna need this. It just doesn't seem very safe using a flashlight. Because obviously people are gonna notice the flashlight, right? the subway? Am I even going in the right direction here? Uh oh. Okay, let's maybe try down here. NSF terrorists in the subway have threatened to blow up the platform. Watch for booby traps. Okay. If there's any traps with boobies, I'm on it. Sir. Who are you? Okay. I'm a UNATCO agent. As soon as I open the train doors, I need you both to be ready to run on board. Okay. <clears throat> Good work. The hostages will be all right. Now take the train to Hell's Kitchen and report to your brother. Please don't walk through that. No, you didn't. Just spin the train. You saved my life! Damn right I did. If you were more attractive, I'd uh, capitalize on that. I'll be okay, thanks. You, on the other hand, maybe not so much. Ooh, let's read the news. Water advisory. Brooklyn Naval Shipyards. Battery Park is closed. Be safe, be suspicious. <laughs> Quite simply, terrorism is successful because terrorists are able to pass unnoticed and remarked upon. But they fail to count on the best intelligent network ever devised. The American people. If any of you guys are American, I'm going to avoid making the, uh, the joke. How can you tell who might be a terrorist? Look for the following characteristics. A stranger or foreigner? <laughs> oh boy. Spends a greater than average amount of time on the net. Wow, so essentially what that does is describe most everybody in the universe. And you just basically suspect everybody of everything. Everybody is a terrorist. Okay, so. They were gonna blow the whole place oh my. situation Us? here. Them? You're taking over. Everything. I've got to get my team ready to raid the warehouse. What about the EMP field? Still in place. Your primary objective will be to locate and disable its power source. Probably an industrial-sized generator in a large building. I'll question some of the locals. I ordered the civilians to take cover a block south of here in the free clinic and at the Underworld Tavern, down on the corner. Maybe I'll start with the tavern. Why'd you have to clear the street? There's still a heavy NSF presence in the streets and we're taking some fire. We could use your help if you get the chance. Maybe I'll do that. If you need any extra equipment, here's the key to my place at the Tun Hotel. Check the secret closet. Remember? The keypad's behind the painting. Just like the movies. Second floor, right? Yeah, and take a charger for the riot prod. We don't need another Anna Navarra shooting spree. 
Whatever you say. And JC, we'll be waiting for you to take down that EMP field. Yeah. If they hadn't run off and killed everybody, I would have been getting commended for being amazing there. So annoying. Okay, so. Reading reports of a hostage Hell situation kitchen. in the Ton Hotel, which is at the southeast corner of the block. When you stayed with Paul, did you meet Mr. Renton and his daughter Sandra? We think at least one of them is still inside. Well, hello, Mr. Levitating Corpse. I guess rigor mortis is already, already set in. Or not. Is that a terrorist guy over there? No, it's just the bums. Oh, but one of them's got a crowbar. We better not, better not mess with that guy. I mean, so we have weaponry. There's some ammo. Taking that ammo, whether you like it or not. You there, you're a police officer. Speak to me. Talk to one of the guys in green. You net goes running the show today. Talks like a New York cop. Armored like special forces. Has a hilarious screen on his face. What I'm telling you, girl? You said I didn't have to. Make Janie do it. I already took the money. And when it's JoJo and it's something he wants, you gotta do it. You and me both, baby. We helpless. We were just gonna hang out today. I told you how it don't play with me, this amateur, unprofessional bullshit. Johnny. If it's business, it's business. If it's us two hanging out, then we hang out. Right now, it's business. I want out, Johnny. I didn't know it would get like this. I'm gonna Put it interfere. this way. You in it. You want out is like a game. You get what you want. Hmm. <laughs> You've got 10 seconds to beat it before I add you to the list of NSF casualties. Easy, bro. Just having us a conversation. Five seconds. Girl's got a head full of marbles. I have to get. Well, she don't hear me. Three. She skitters on me. It's my ass, man. One. All right. Go on. Jesus. Yep. Run, run away. Thanks. Sucks to get backed into a corner. I was trying to find the back way into smugglers. Smuggler? Hey, you Smuggler. shouldn't have threatened Johnny. Soon as Jojo finds out. Who's this Jojo? You can't touch Jojo. He doesn't go out and there's only two ways to the warehouse. Warehouse? You think he can sneak into Osgood's at the park, but in the first place, it's locked. The park? Where Unatco has the NSF pinned down? And if you go underground, he's got laser trip wires, drone guns, military type stuff, plus there are guards on the roof. Tell you what, I'll handle Jojo. You stay out of the way until the NSF have pulled back. I can take care of myself. You mentioned a smuggler. Tough guy like you, figured hmm. you'd be a big yep. customer. What's he sell? Weapons? Drugs? High-priced weapons, yeah, you should talk to him. His place is over near the subway. You have to give him the password bloodshot or he won't let you in. Thanks already. Now leave me alone. House of Pain. Fifth Street, Broadway. Got it. Yeah. <gasps> Hello, Data Q. So as soon as we find an ATM, we're busting that. Under the fence. Denton. Hey, it's Denton. Hi. You want these? What? Give him the grenades. Look, I know he's your brother, but... Your brother gave us these things. Look at this. Irritation to all exposed mucous membranes. What's that gonna do? Just tell Paul to give us bullets next time. Here's one. Prolonged exposure can damage <laughs> the bronchial pathways. Prolonged exposure? It's like giving them cigarettes or something. 
Look, do you want these things? Keep them. Those things save Keep lives. Em. Those things save lives. Terrorist lives, you mean? You're just like your brother. If I had your abilities, people would be safe around here. Uh. Well, you have some ammo. Do you not have guns? Okay. Front door. Sawn off shotgun. So I guess that opens that door. Excellent. Okay. We'll take it from here. What's your business here, Agent? Just going up to my brother's room. Uh, you better hold off. The uh -huh. NSF retreated in there about half an hour ago, and they've taken hostages. We're waiting on a specialist. Oh, this is the one from outside. I'm your specialist. Hotel, I guess. Just tell me where the hostages are being held. No one's standing in your way, but you'll have to go in alone. Our orders are to hold the perimeter. We think the terrorists are on the second floor. Carry on, Corporal. Agent? This guy. All clear. Crates. Come on, come on. Open for me. That's a phrase you should all memorize. We took them out. You sure did. They are now, in fact, out. Most assuredly. We have the situation under control, Free Agent. clinic. So I think I can hide a shotgun in here. It's probably a med bot to install that. Or canister too. No weapons allowed beyond this point. Okay. Maybe they were right. head cops are running scared. I'm hiding it all. Reminds me of Washington. I was there when the NSF overran squad. So who do I want to talk to? The nurse. If you think you have gray death, please pick up an information packet. Plague victims can have their medication mailed to their homes at no additional cost. Yep, I definitely have no weapons. You can't see a thing. Good times, good times. Alright, alright. Nice little park in there. You got a few credits? You have the plague? Nah. Cops ran us off the streets. Usually I go into the water tunnels in the warehouse district, but somebody boarded up the window. You live in a tunnel? Actually, I like to stay on the roof of this big apartment building. Nice view, if it's not too cold. There's a freight elevator at the end of the tunnel. Where's that window you were talking about? It's a basement window in the park south of the hotel. One of the doctors can help you. One of the doctors can help you. You, you look like the do-it-yourself type. How about the automated care plan? Only 2,000 credits. Med kits are 300, but if you want augmentation work, you need the bots. <laughs> Never mind. As you wish. 2,000, huh? You must pay the doctors in cash before treatment can begin. Four tools to get in? Four? God, really? Welcome to Tenderloin Clinic. Tenderloin, huh? Please proceed to the examining room. Now, am I going to get into trouble if I do this? Let's give it a go. They might get funny with me about this. I don't know. We accept all forms of digital cash. Maybe Please not. have your card ready. I want to know if there's an access code for that or... Plague tests are free. 
bad. Sure I want satisfaction. Hand. We've done all that we can. It's time for you to go. This is supposed to be a free clinic. Bet you do something if I had more money. You've got the plague, sir. You know, rich people don't get great death. Oh, wait. I just repeatedly read the same paper for information and I still find completely nothing. Oh god, the phone! Not while I'm using the keyboard! Okay... No codes there. That I saw, anyway. Vectors! The vectors are all wrong! The vectors are all wrong. This must be Russian. <laughs> Wait your turn. Here we go. Let's be. You should be more appreciative. By helping you, this gentleman risks his own health. But he won't give me any medicine. Trust me. When there's a cure, the city will underwrite the cost. The virus threatens everyone. I don't believe you. And I won't hesitate to prescribe the treatment for you. You better not. Hello, Doctor. Thank you. The ones with the plague can be so stubborn sometimes. Don't mention it. Let me express my gratitude. You can have the automated care plan for 1200 That's at a 40% discount. Or a med kit for 180 Ah... <sighs> Never mind. Let's see how much credit Suit yourself. I've got. Yeah, I'm, I'm not a huge fan of that right now. I want to find a way in. That... Can I get in there? Okay. Please do not disturb the other patients. This question of what's worth more to me: four multi tools or? Have we got any points to sink into a skill yet? Not enough. Not nearly enough. Okay. I have other patients to attend to. The data cubes. Well, dang. Twelve hundred is still way steep. Christ! You see the guy begging for a cure? Yeah. What about him? It won't help. There is no cure. How do you know? They show you stuff in the okay, military. What's in this? You want to know the real battlefield? It's microscopic. We can't even see it. Lucky for me, I got immunizations. But that guy? Well, once you're infected, you're infected. Well, because they won't let me in for free, for being amazing, I'm just going to see to it that the next guy who comes in chatting is gonna have exactly what he needs to ruin his day. I said drop, not equip. Drop. Okay. So far, so good. I just dropped candy bar too. I gotta eat. Dude's gotta eat. Okay, we'll. S yes. We'll save you for when we're back at HQ, and we can install you using one of our own medbots. It's probably a much cleaner medbot. I wish to hell they'd give us the all clear. I figure let's go and solve a hostage crisis, cause we're just that cool. Hey guy. Hey. All clear. All clear. <laughs> Okay, let's get in the front door here. Don't take any unnecessary risks. I won't take any unnecessary risks. Let's creep under because, because, because. Public access? Is this going to have the same news? Mm, yep, pretty much. So, where's that ATM code we had from before? Goals, notes. Um, 
We've been through quite a few. 947761. 2867. No, that's the news terminal. Six one and two eight four seven. No. Ah. Yeah, there's no auto entry. Two eight six seven. Oh, all of that for sixty two. Well, we can still hack it. That's always good. See? Don't get much more out of that. Okay, let's move the garbage bag. Let's try and step on this rat. Come on. Come on. Come on. Got him. Let's reload the riot prod. And let's reload the crossbow. Okay, let's go south. You better get out of here, Mr. Renton. Terrorists have taken cover <laughs> inside the hotel. Yeah. Ah, can't leave the desk unattended. You'll be caught in the crossfire. I have to order you to leave the building. I'm not supposed to have yes, that camera angle. Yes, of course. I'll close up in a second. Hide the body. Take the key, take his credits. Let's let's drop his crappy pistol. Cause you know. You alright, Mr. Renton? Fine, be careful though, they've got more hostages up on the second floor. I'll check it out. By the way, I saw your daughter down the street. She didn't look so good. Sandra? Was she coming back to the hotel? I ran off a thug who was harassing her, but she's still mixed up in some pretty nasty business. You better talk to her. No. No more talking. If you see her, tell her I don't care what she's been doing. She can come home. No questions, no speeches. I'll tell her she can trust you. Ah. <sighs> Restore the family. One dart. Well, okay. So obviously the way to approach this is this. Hello, crate. Oh, jumping on a crate is much more effective. you have photosensitive epilepsy, I suggest you stop looking at the screen several seconds before I gave you this warning. Alright. <laughs> Don't step on the rat. Don't step on the rat. Help! What the hell? Guy? Who said you could do that? Well, that... That was incredibly irritating. God damn it. Okay, that there, that's false mark. We're gonna go in there later. Get out of my way, plant. Aha! 
Oh, we already hacked the terminal. You can't type them in once you've already hacked the terminal because it breaks it. Okay, let's open this one. Let's rob it blind. Well, this looks like a well-equipped place. It's locked. Oh. So, apparently, they dosed up and overdosed. Got it. Is this door weak enough that I can break it with a knife? No, it's not. Do I want to use this? Absolutely. Hoorah! Yes! A med kit! I always wanted a med kit. Okay. Well, damn. I think that's all of them. You got the guys upstairs? Yeah, you can have your hotel back. The hotel? Good. Now we just have to kick these punks out of Manhattan. My so, brother Paul's heading up the operation. The NSF won't have New York for long. I'm having a bit of a haphazard record with actually keeping people alive. Um... Yeah. Uh, there hey, were a couple of doing? NSF on the second floor. I took care of the situation. What about the hostages? Not all of them made it, but I played by the book. No deals with terrorists. You should have waited for the specialist. Kiss my ass, man. At least it's over. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Shut up. Damn. Damn is all I can say. Okay. The Underworld. Incidentally, if you ever stop by London and you happen to be in the Camden area, just across from the tube station, Look for the underworld. Fabulous place. And I practically lived in there. Uh, 543654. Four. Okay. And was it 5544? Four, four? Yeah, I swear I'll just start writing these down. Five four three six five four. Oh, so it's just counting back. What the hell is the access code? Yeah. Doesn't want to work. Am I reading this one wrong? Let's try on this one. Nope, won't let us into it. I guess it only works in the hotel one or something. Which doesn't make any sense. Either way, disinterested. Taking their money so that I can not spend it. But here's the Deus Ex Underworld. I am Brosia from a drug dealer. We're talking about your wife, the Great Death. I don't know. If I gave it to her and it was cut. JoJo's good for it. People know him. He'd be hanging from a streetlight if he was selling bad vaccine. Hey, Shay, Cape Cod. Here's a little vodka this time. Let's yes. just put it. <laughs> Tell me where you plan to get on brochure, or I'll make sure you're arrested on conspiracy charges. No, let's, let's be nice. Just curious. I thought I heard you say Ambrosia. My wife has the plague. He already lost his daughter. Sorry to hear that. 
So do I trust some street punk called Jojo to get me pharmaceuticals? Trust him with my wife's life? I thought Ambrosia was an urban legend. Jojo probably just wants to sound like a player. I shouldn't get my hopes up. I don't know what to say. You just have to do what you think is right. Good advice, man. Let's just drink some whiskey. A lot of whiskey. Just in fact, bottles of burp. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah. Now this effect... I can tell you something interesting about certain recreational stuff when it goes really far south, but I'm going to pretend that I know nothing about that. So... Good. You the guy that helped Sandra? I think your friend is going to be alright. What about Johnny? I gave him a good scare. Where's he at? I don't know, but if he gives you any more trouble, just tell me. I hope he doesn't think I ratted him out. What can you tell me about his boss, Jojo? Oh, Jojo, he's nothing, man. We used to go out. His body mods? Cosmetic. Scars? I saw him cut his face one time just so he'd look mean. Maybe I'll straighten him out as well. Well, if you ever want to get into the warehouse where he hides out, I know the code. It's 3316. Thanks. You've been very helpful. She has. Jojo shouldn't stick us with guys like Johnny. That ain't cool. I talked to your father. He asked me to invite you back home. No strings attached. How sweet. You could at least let your father know you're alright. He knows where I am. You mad at him or something? No, but I don't want him running my life like he runs that cheap hotel. He doesn't do such a bad job. He never got nowhere because he never took chances. That ain't me. I'm gonna do things my way. I think you should be more grateful for what he's done. Let's leave it at that. I'd say this is a distinct difference between my life and hers. Just casually judging it, though. 